Hey guys, hey, what's going on? Good evening. Hey, right now I'm on the uh, the pit box today, and I got my pit preheating with my pellet system today, uh, especially when it's cold. I like to come out, put my meat on, and then turn it up to 180, and just let the pit preheat for about an hour with the meat on. And then uh, later on, probably about an hour or so, I'm gonna light that chimney right there, and then uh, start my cook about 9.30. So it is currently, 8 30 now pit just came on and it's when you turn that pillar system on man it sounds like a jet engine clear out that's okay that's still good smoke it's just now starting up i'm going to clear out just a little bit so you can guys actually see the the smoke and the meat that's in there it's going to give a lot of smoke for about maybe a couple minutes and then it'll, it'll clear out and start burning clean but we're gonna come back in just a minute uh but i am running some char logs today uh for, that's for my initial burn to start off with once i preheat my my pit for about you know 30 minutes about 9 30 and then i'm gonna drop my stuff in there but looking in the back my bottle is still closed i have my uh char logs in here with some post oak okay this simple setup man this regular uh, minion method you know little small splits and i'm gonna drop them lit uh, lit coals right there in the corner and then open up my baffle all right but i got three briskets on and I actually got uh you know some uh, some clods. i got two clods in there that i didn't you know slice up i'm gonna cook my hole this time but i'm gonna keep that wide open because i'm gonna run about 250 and that's side and this side is gonna stay closed okay all right so you can see the smoke did clear out it only takes a couple minutes and you can see that pillar system down there is working again that was just initial burn off with the pillars coming on to get the, to get the uh, pit up the temp and i'm just gonna smoke it at 180 you know preheat for 180. then i'm gonna turn it off and then drop that lit uh drop the lit chocolates but I got some big briskets in here. Three briskets, and they're ranging, uh, I think the smallest one I got is 15 pounds. And these are the beef shoulders. Usually, guys, I like to, you know, take my beef shoulders, you know, I will slice them in half, then I will, then I will quarter them into fours off of one beef cloth. Okay. But I didn't feel like putting my other racks in to do that. I'm just gonna cook them whole this time. Good. Love the pillar system when it's cold, but I'll tell you what, it's it's about 18 degrees out here right now. It's, it's gonna get even colder tonight. Uh, so that's why sometimes it's good to have that pillar system come on in, turn it down to 180. You don't need to go to 225. 180 is perfect, you know, to bring your, uh, your pit up the temp uh, to about 180 to 200 degrees and drop that lip charcoal and you'll be fine. Very versatile. All right, and then I got my propane system right there. You can also preheat with that, but I find it easier just to turn the gal on the pellet system. Okay, so we're gonna leave this alone for about uh, 30 minutes. And then I'm gonna start my pit with my lit charcoal with some char logs about nine o'clock and I'll drop those in about 30 to 45 minutes, okay? Hey, that's the, uh, that's the pit balls, guys. Hey, and I bring you back early in the morning. So with the amount of fuel I got in there, it's I should get up about 4:30 to 5 o'clock uh, to go ahead and start wrapping up this cook. All right. Hey, blessings to you, and uh, we'll talk to you later.